Fred. We saw yesterday uh, how well she was hitting it. And on the conversely, Goff a little bit uncertain. So she'll be looking to drive that advantage home. Okay, well in the first two points, we've had a forehand. She could have controlled the ball a lot better than she would do now. Time that one, trying to consolidate this break. faults against Elisa Mertens and against Lucia Bronzetti. Three today already for Goff. thought she hadn't done enough but then it looked like the ball moved a bit I don't again that could be the wind and Yuan just not quite in the right position so well it was, it was a bit scrappy but she got the job done earlier in this game that her record was six against Mertens in the entirety of the match yesterday and the same Bronzetti on Monday she's up to six already here it is windy well, at least her team would be hoping that well, maybe that's the problem though it's having to do all the heavy lifting Part of the reason for these double faults is the points one on second serve. She's down at 27% today. That plunged to 18% to against Elisa Mertens yesterday, even though she still won so comfortably. It's also windy. We have to get really irritated by it, which is understandable. Is it the ball toss? What, what technically is going wrong here? I think she needs to go with more slice. I think she's going with the kicker, and the kicker is just not working for her. Talk so much, Dom, about the you conditions are. here in Indian Wells and the balls flying as well. It's it's like a double-edged sword, isn't it? You're contending. Points one after the first serve is made, so she's still not doing too bad there. Her problem is when she Three misses that first serve, she's then missing half of her second. Is that she is 
a juggernaut when she takes the opening set. She's 47 wins, six defeats at WTA 1000 events when she takes the first set. Set her game. Oh. Well, you start to lose faith in everything. When one of the foundation stones is wobbling, as the serve is, that's twined as well as technique. What is she doing wrong? <laughs> I mean, clearly she doesn't, she's just not really sure. I think she... just turned a little bit of a corner in creeps double fault just to remind her that it's going to linger around a little longer minded that you're going to be aggressive that's what she has to maintain even when she's up in the game This is an unwanted record for her, no matter what happens over the course of the next hour or so. You go off to an outside court with a, a, a bunch of balls and practice the serve on the forehand, or do you just go, actually, no? Well, it depends, because it's quite likely that she did that after the first match, and, and or the, the last match, and, and you would go out there and you start hitting the ball fantastic, and you just can't explain it. I've, you know, I've been through those situations, I'm sure a lot of players have, where they go to the practice court, everything is working absolutely fantastic. You just think, where's that been? Oh. That's the tricky part, is it's just so hard. Well, she struggled, didn't she, in Cancun at the WTA finals against Von Drosova with the serve. I think there were 17 double faults that day. Not quite there yet. spoke too soon she is now again just it's getting used to the fact that she's now back with the wind I think